Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the water and ice dispenser actuator in this GE refrigerator, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver and a narrow small flathead screwdriver. Before you begin the procedure, unplug the appliance's power cord. You can insert a narrow small flathead screwdriver or comparable size tool into the holes on the bottom of the funnel and paddle assembly to help detach the display control. Disconnect the three wire harness connectors to fully release the control. Using the Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the four mounting screws to release the funnel and paddle assembly. Next, unthread the two screws securing the dispenser actuator. Detach the ice chute door from the old actuator. To prepare the new dispenser actuator for installation, transfer the spring from the old actuator to the new one. Now insert the ice chute door hooks into the slot and snap the upper tabs into place. Apply tension to the spring as you insert the actuator lever into the slot in the solenoid and position the actuator in the slots in the dispenser housing. Align the retaining brackets, then thread the two mounting screws to secure. Feed the wires through the funnel and paddle assembly as you position the assembly in the housing. Secure the assembly with the four screws. Reconnect the three wire harness connectors to the appropriate terminals on the back of the display control. Reposition the control by aligning the top edge first, then snap the bottom edge into place. Plug the appliance's power cord back in and the refrigerator should be ready for use.